think perp decks or perp as a product is like a superior trading product this 24 7 is it has no expiry day it's easier to understand it provides very flexible effort use what that means is i expect to see what i call the perpetualization of everything like now we see perpetualized futures uh crypto you're seeing some of this stock being perpetualized but then technically we can perpetualize even more of other assets so i think in 2026 we might see more of those like some innovative products like their own perpetual trading markets and i uh, kind of uh, explode so i think that is one uh, interesting area that we're looking at also uh everyone is trying to improve the capital efficiency meaning like how we can generate yield for the underlying collateral while people are trading so we can earn and trade astra has been doing that for quite a while yes the app has been around for like for a long time but we're also looking to provide more of those earn and trade strategy for our users so that they can maximize like their profits basically so and i think more and more people are going to move into decentralized uh, exchanges uh, including yeah. aster and i think what we're trying to do uh, providing that private options to our user will speed up that general adoption uh, because like a lot of users that we talk to, like they actually don't want to expose their trading strategy. They don't want to give out trading signals uh, when they trade. And most of the DEX solution right now in the market actually, like, while being fully transparent, lack the option of like hiding some of like the things that they do not want to disclose. So I think uh, with Esther rolling out the uh, Esther chain with the privacy option, uh, we will see another wave of uh, strategy being moved to uh, the decentralized infrastructure and probably speed up the entire adoption of the PerpDex.